Hi, Paul again. Um, this is the guitar I've been playing. This is the guitar I took to Japan. This is the guitar I've been playing a lot and playing in the studio. Um, people have been using it in the studio to record tracks. It's my guitar. It has something we call brush stroke birds. If you back up, it looks just like birds, but real close up, they're kind of an artist's rendition of the birds from a distance, right? This is the first prototype of a guitar we're releasing at NAMM. 2013, go figure, they named it Paul's Guitar, but it is a production version of my private stock. It's every bit the guitar this is. This one is in a uh, beautiful copper color. This one's uh, more of a, a dirty violin color, um, but it's the same inlays, it's the same pickups, it's the same neck shape, it's the same everything. Um, this one has mammoth ivory inlays from a mastodon or a mammoth, right? And these are uh, an, an ivroid. So, I mean, you're not paying for the uh, <laughs> mastodon ivory like you would in private stock, but it's the same guitar. And um, they decided to name it Paul's Guitar. And well, once again, go figure, but whatever. Um, I think it's beautiful. Uh, we've got a new, um, ultra thin finish on it. This has a fretboard that's made out of the same wood that they make concert marimbas out of. Uh, this is the prototype. Um, you can tell because it's missing the truss rod cover, right? But this is what we're going to release at the show and we're really pleased with it. We like the sound of these new 408 pickups. We found out if you put a 408 pickup from our bass position in the treble position and wound it up like a treble pickup, it sounded gorgeous. So it's got a real high mid-range clarity to it. There's something really cool about these. I like them. I'm using them. You want one, we'll make you one in production without paying the private stock money. So there you go.